Guys, one of my YouTube subscribers had asked me to do a video on my Nortel BCM50 phone system. Um, I have a BCM50, which is branded by Avaya, which is um, um, Avaya bought Nortel out, and when it went bankrupt. So this is a BCM50. Let me tip it on the side here. It's laying on its side because I don't, because it has a wall mount and it has a breakout card. Um, it, th this is a very messy wiring job I did. Um, what was previous here was a Merlin Magic Zone system, so, and I converted it to a Nortel about a year and a half ago. Um, this cable out right here is for the analog, st analog station uh, module, which I can't get it to work. I think the module is bad. And then I have a uh, 4 by 16 card, 4 extra lines, incoming lines, and 16 more digital extensions. And this is what the expansion ports look like. Uh, this one is a 4 by 6, I mean a 4 by 16, 4 incoming lines. And one is an aux line. I, you can hook up a fax machine to that. And Amphenol connectors for the 16 digital extensions. Second one is analog uh, station interface, uh, which I cannot get it to work no matter what I do. And the very top one is the power supply uh, module that you can buy um, for three, you know, for three different units here. Um, the BCM is plugged into that. The two um, additional. Um, uh, they're just on top of a box here. Uh, this is a very small cl closed space. So I, I really have to take the time and really clean this up, uh, which I would like to do one of these days. Uh, but that's what the breakout card looks like here. If that helps. And I do have another breakout card which I can. Um, show you in a second here uh, but this is a fully a full a fully loaded BCM 50 uh, release 6 um, the last version that they made um, I think it has 500 voicemail license to uh, voicemail uh, users uh, license to it um, if you want because the the, the base BCM only has four incoming lines. If you need more, you will need to get one of these. Um, four by 16, or I think they do just make four incoming line car, uh, module as well. And if you want additional um, analog stations, because it only contains four. Uh, right now, I have two analog station modules, ATAs, that's what they really should be called. And this is what they look here. Got this off of eBay dirt cheap. So one plugs into the KSU as a digital extension and then it goes out as a regular analog extension. I got the analog extension, uh, analog um, station um, interface to eliminate the eight ATAs. Uh, but like I said, I can't get them to uh, the analog station interface to work, no matter what I do in the system programming. And if you want additional lines, uh, I do have plans to do other stuff with the incoming lines, uh, hook up other additional equipment. Um, so all in all, that's what it looks like. Very, very messy wiring. <laughs> So if you have any questions or comments, please post them below. And just a second, I'll show you what a breakout adapter looks like for the Nortels. Okay, I'm back. Here is the Nortel uh, breakout adapter for the BCM50. Uh, really, it could be used for um, any um, Nortel product that has an FNL cable. Uh, if you can figure out which pairs go to these, because you can hook these up as, as phones when you do that. Um, these group is for the outside line, so line 1, 2, 3, and 4. And then you have the analog extensions, you know, 1, 2, 3, and 4. 
and then you have the 12 uh, digital uh, extensions for the 12 phones. Uh, so if you're not using all 12, you can add more di uh, more analog extensions by using analog uh, uh, terminal adapter. So you can do it that way. And you got your uh, music on hold, um, uh, music on hold page. Uh, page contact closures as well as an external bell that you can hook up on the on these uh, but um, if you do find the I do have the pin out but you can also hook up additional phones uh, you can also um, hook this up to any phone system that uses the standard 25 pair cable um, one pair each um, you just have to, I believe, this would be the blue, orange, I think that's how it goes, if I, if I remember correctly, on the 25 pair cable. So all, that's all it is, is just a breakout adapter. Makes it, it makes it easy to install one of these suckers. If you have any questions, comments, please post them below.